Good morning, everyone. Today, we're gonna do a math activity. So the materials that you need, you can find around your house. So I have a piece of paper. I'm gonna put it up so you guys can see what I'm doing, but I just wanted to say hi. <laughs> so I'm gonna move it, okay? All right, so I have a regular piece of paper. Hold on guys, sorry. So a regular piece of paper. I folded it in half and then I folded it in half again. And then I open it up and I have one, two, three, four boxes. And then the other thing you need is coins. Not cash, but coins. So I have a whole bunch of coins. So what we're gonna do, all right, I'm gonna just draw a black line to make the cross. And we're going to sort the coins. So you guys, we have pennies. So I'm gonna write pennies. And we have nickels. Then we have dimes. And then we have quarters. So we are going to sort pennies, nickels, dimes, and quarters. And then, so I'm not going to do my whole bucket. You guys definitely can do your whole whatever, how much mommy and daddy give you. Um, and then I'm only going to do a portion of it. And then we're going to count how many we have. And then I can tell you how much money because, so a penny is worth one cent. One cent. A nickel is worth five cents. A dime is 10 cents. And a quarter is 25 cents. So, let's start. I'm gonna just take a handful out of my bucket. Do you guys know what this is? A quarter, good job. And what about this one? A dime. So I'm gonna continue to sort. Maybe you guys can join me and help me, how you guys are sorting too. So I'm only gonna do this one hand and see how much we got and then we're gonna see who has less and who has more Ooh. almost done guys my hands almost empty Make sure you wash your hands after you play with the coins, okay, guys? Okay. So, now that you sorted it, right? Okay. I'm going to turn this around so you guys can actually read it because... No. It's upside down to me. Sorry, guys. All right. So, let's start with the pennies. All right. You guys are going to help me count. Ready? One two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. We have fifteen cents, which is fifteen pennies because each penny is one cent. All right, next is 
nickels. So these nickels are five cents. So it might be a little difficult for you guys for the rest of them, but I will help. Um, you're just gonna help me count how many there are and then I will tell you how much cents it is. All right, ready guys? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we have seven nickels. And hold on one second, guys. So it's 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. So seven nickels equals 35 cents. Okay. Do you want to do dimes or quarters? Let's do quarters. I love quarters. All right. So let's count how many quarters we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we have ten quarters. And four quarters equals one dollar. So we have four quarters, four quarters, and two quarters. So we got one, two dollars and 25 50 50 cents good job guys all right so dimes are a little easy because you count to buy tens and it's a little bit easier so we're gonna count how many dimes we have ready one two three four five six seven eight nine so we have nine dimes so you want to help me count by tens some of you can do it but i think all of you can try ready 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 so we have 90 cents so we could add all this up together so we can do, let's see where I can do it. I'll do it on a separate piece of paper. All right, so we have, I'll start with the quarters because it has the most, so it's 250. And then we have 90 cents. And then we have 35 cents, so it's five, seven. And then we'll carry it over here because I don't have room at the bottom. 15 cents. So all this equals $3.90. How cool is that, guys? All right, so you guys go try and see how much you guys have in your sorting. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Missed you.